The Troy women basketball team fell six points short Saturday against Louisiana Lafayette, 79-73, to ending their nine-game winning streak. Although the Trojans had a slow start in the first quarter, they continued to show effort and fight to get the momentum started. The Trojans put up 16 points in the first quarter and only 14 points in the second. But senior guard Jasmine Robinson put up a total of 20 points this game and tied her career high for made threes in a game. It might be one of the biggest uh, lines of development uh, that I've ever seen as a coach. I mean, the improvement that she's made. And, you know, we love to get transfers. We love to get junior college players. But she's one that we had since she was a freshman. And we took a lot of lumps with her, good times and bad, growing up. But she has grown up. And hats off to her, the amount of determination. Um, she's had lows. She had to be a point guard very early for us. As a freshman, she had to start many, many games for us. And so she took a lot of lumps. But she's come back. Talk about the rebound. She rebounds well and she works hard after a loss and that kind of thing. So her improvement is off the charts. Troy came into the second half, dropping 22 points in the third quarter. Senior forward Japonica James continued to be a beast on the court. James shot 80% from the field and had a total of 20 points this game. She hasn't been back in the groove since we've been off from our Christmas break. And to me, that's almost expected. It's like she has to come back, get focused, get focused in and dialed in and get her body back in tune to basketball. And so I'm thankful that she showed back up today. And I think it's just going to keep getting better and better with her here on, from here on out. After outscoring Louisiana 22-14 to in the third quarter and taking a 52-49 to lead into the fourth quarter, the Trojans struggled to stop Louisiana's Mikhail Hellman, who scored back-to-back, -back, ending with a total of 14 points all in the fourth quarter. Number five, I believe, is a freshman, and, you know, we really didn't expect her to come out and go four for five in the fourth quarter, but we have to be prepared for things like that. So that's one way we would start. We would start there and work backwards, like what happens when a shooter gets hot in the, in the midst of a game. After this tough loss, the Trojans are back on the road this week on Thursday as they travel to Georgia Southern for another conference game. Jessica Phillips, Troy, Trojan Vision Sports.